Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're looking at the Black Crown deck from thebluecrown.com. Uh, what is the Black Crown deck? Well, this year, 2016, Blue Crown released this black uh, colored deck uh, on their Black Friday. So this was their uh, one of their Christmas decks that they had through the holiday season. And if you don't know, the Blue Crown releases a uh, crown deck pretty much once every time their previous color sells out. Uh, this is their staple deck, and I'm glad for it because this is a favorite of mine. I really like the crown deck, and I always hope that they continue to print this. Um, the crown deck is a signature deck, like I said, and it's designed to evoke uh, a, this, a, a feeling of quality elegance and style. If you look at the back of the crown deck, you'll notice that it has a very Tally Ho inspired back design, and then you have Arco faces, and I think that offers a very timeless appeal. You're going to get top quality stock and finish for ultimate handling and longevity, and each one of these decks, like I said, is printed from the United States Playing Card Company using their very high quality stock and finish to ensure lasting quality, durability, and handling superiority. Just like previous crown decks, uh, the tuck case is the same, other than the fact that it's been shaded in black. And so it just simply says the crown deck across the front there, and it has a picture of their exploded ace pip. Uh, one side says the blue crown, and the other side says the United States Playing Card Company made in the USA. The bottom, of course, has some ad copy about the blue crown, and the top is completely blank. And of course, there is no tuck seal, which is awesome. The back design is, of course, the back design of the cards, and the tongue flap has the URL for the blue crown. That is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. Like I said, these cards are printed from the United States Playing Card Company and they come on uh, their retail stock. Each one has a modern cut and air cushion embossed. And if you'd like to learn more about stock, cut, or finish, you can click the link below in the description. A lot of people always ask how these cards feel and handle. Uh, the best thing I can do is measure them for you. Measure them and give you a, a kind of a standard to go by and you can compare them against other decks that you've previously held or owned. Uh, if I take 10 of these cards, that's my staple, that's my standard, 10 cards, put it into a caliper, uh, the measurement I get is 2.82. Now 2.82 is about middle ground for uh, USPCC. Could be a really thick retail stock or a really thin casino stock. USPCC isn't always uh, on point with their measurements and so I would just say it's gonna be the same thickness as the Sons of Liberty deck if you have that one or some of the knock decks. As you can see there's that Tally Ho inspired back design. You got a crown on top, a crown on the bottom making it a two-way image then you have some uh, flourishy patterns there in the corner amidst a giant field of black. With this deck you'll get two original jokers both identical. There you have stars in the corner they say joker. You have the crown icon there in the center and uh, the crown is embellished with the different four suits. Because the blue crown makes decks for magicians you're going to get two gaff cards. One is a blank face card and the other is a double backer which are great for magic tricks. Your ace of spades is a very beautiful a very embellished ace uh, pip and it's very exploded very large. It does say the crown deck and the United States playing card company underneath. Your pips and indice cards will all be completely standard and instantly recognizable for game Play and magic. Like I said, your court cards are all going to be Arco courts, which I think uh, adds to the richness and longevity of this, this classical look. All right, so that is my review of the Black Crown deck from the Blue Crown. Uh, I purchased mine from thebluecrown.com, and that's where I would suggest you get yours as well. As always, we ask that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magicorthodoxy, twitter.com slash magicorthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy, and if you need more content, you can always find it at magicorthodoxy.com. Thanks, bye.